right It's hard to breathe, but that's alright Hush If you're ever feeling down, just remember, it's not about what you bring to the table, it's how fast you bring the table. I swear, that F-150 just reacted faster than me stepping on a Lego. I guarantee you that was a very quiet ride home, with him and his soggy pants. There's gotta be more tread underneath these wires, man. Just keep clipping it. We're gonna regroove it. I don't know why they're trying to get rid of that. That's the best part of the tire. It's normally made for snow use, kind of like uh, snow chains. It's like an all-season tire. He just used up his summer tires too quickly. Why do I feel like that worked better? I at least hope this guy put on his OSHA certified safety squints. Because I'll tell you right now, I was using my safety squints watching this video. It's a thousand dollars a minute for you to hold me here just to let you know. You know, whenever they said we would have hover cars in the future, I do not think this is exactly what they meant. I am actually really impressed with whoever hitched up that trailer. That dude deserves a raise. I guess they're just going to be shipping the whole truck and trailer as a package now. I just hope nobody's actually in that truck right now. Because if so, they're going for a ride. So I found the easiest way to grease driveline U-joints. Uh, step one, turn the truck over. Step two, forget your grease gun inside the truck and have to flip it back over to grab the grease gun just so you can do it all over again. I will agree with this man. It definitely makes it easier than sticking it on a lift. And here I thought top fuel dragsters used a lot of fuel. This dude's GPM is 100. With the gallons per mile that high, this dude's got to be running 70,000 cc injectors and 967,000 wheel horsepower. Wait, have I been doing this wrong my entire life? Can we just quick disconnect springs like this? Like this man is running a whole strut delete. This man is running the I want pain 5000. That's one way to adjust ride height that will. Running the all new adjustable coil springs. The truck decided it wanted to be an external combustion engine. The boss man says this morning, he says, uh, hey, you think maybe you could go one day without fucking up? I said, absolutely, boss man. You ready? I said, let's... Yeah. It's gonna blow it off the fucking let's, beat. Let's, let's start that tomorrow, though, because... Uh, I should probably put a disclaimer on this one. Do not attempt this at home. Alrighty, with that out of the way, here it is in slow-mo. For the people that want to see it. I swear, this man was trying to launch five tons into the stratosphere. He was using enough spicy air to turn this John Deere into a competitional hopper. Welcome back to the channel, guys. I just wanted to hop on here and say thank you so much for all the support that I've gotten. I seriously was going to give up on this channel at one point, and it means a lot to me. Whether you've been with me since the beginning of this journey, or you're just tuning in, thank you so much for all y'all's support. I live inside my own world of make-believe Kids screaming in the crowd